And you already know, this is your girl, ooh, Gina, baby, Strong Island Hip Hop Radio. Make sure y'all follow us, S-I-H-H, the number four life. And shout out to GB Sneaker Store, Swaggy. And I got a special, beautiful, talented young lady in the building. I'm introducing her. What up, Vina Live? Hey, hey how you doing? Bless. It's like an honor to have you here. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you. Oh, my God. Like, you know, we're going to start off with who you the daughter of? The legendary DJ. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's all right, but not. <laughs> I'm telling no, you. Um, no, my dad is um, DJ K. Capri. Yes. Like I said, he's all right. He's all right. No, listen, listen. I'm saluting that one right there, man. <laughs> How was it growing up in the house with DJ K. Capri? Um, I actually had a like pretty normal childhood. Like it wasn't okay. like I wasn't a celebrity kid. Yeah. You know? oh. But, um, you celebrity to me. No. <laughs> <laughs> but um, it was definitely, he was always on tour, so like my mom and my grandmother kept all the, you know, 60s yes, music, yes, yes, the definitely 70s, kept the that 80s. Going. So, um, I mean, it was pretty cool. I grew up on music, and I was always yes. dancing and stuff, so. Definitely. You know, it's funny, growing up, I used to watch him on TV, and he was just so much fun and excitement. And you know what's funny with him doing the Martin Lawrence Death of Comedy? Mm-hmm. Oh my God, how was that? Have you watched it with him? Of oh course. yeah, I watch, I watch Def Jam like it's on TV. So, like, I, <laughs> like I watch it over and over again because it's actually real comedy. But um, that's cool. Well, like, <laughs> so what made you want to? Well, obviously, you grew up in the house of music, but what really made you want to, you know, sing? And I know you would um, dance as well. When I when I when I got to high school is when I really realized I could actually sing. Yes. So um I was like always writing poetry and stuff like that. So I was like, all right, well let's try the, you know, making my own songs and stuff. So um when I tried doing that and it worked, I was like, okay, yes, let's go. So like, you, you even write your own song, mm-hmm. your own music, everything. Yep. And you even carry on with your own dance. Mm-hmm. Man, right? So how was it? Did you go to dance school? Yes, I went to uh, I went to like five different dance schools. I started dancing when I was like three years old. And I just kept dancing from there throughout high school. I went to college for dancing and singing. Oh my! Yeah. She went to college. You hear that? Like, I mean, okay. I ain't finished, but no. I tried. But listen, you went. To listen, you went. You said, I'm trying to finish up myself. But yeah, you I know went it. twice. The first time I went to um, John Jay for law. Shout out to John Jay. And then um, I left there, and then I went to Amda. And I was like, you know what? The school thing, I'm over it. I went to action, so. With your beautiful voice, I always picture you walking around the house at the age of five and six just singing like, yeah. la, 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 la. the yeah. Whitney Houston song. No? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, for real. D- to this day, I'm in the house singing all day. So what made, in, in high school, what made you really realize, yo, I can really do this. I can really write and sing. Um, I went to a performing arts school, so I was like, okay. that's what the school was built around. So I, um... As a freshman, you were only allowed to be one thing. So mm-hmm. you were either a dancer or a singer or an actress. Yes. So um, I actually went to audition for a play. And the auditions were only for juniors and seniors. Oh, okay. I was like, Ops. my I'm mom was like, Look, I, you might as well just go do it. So mm-hmm. I did it and I got the lead role. And I was singing Congrats. and dancing. Thank you. So when I saw like that, I was like, I could be on stage, sing and dance and act at the Why same not? time. So I'm sure oh, you yeah. were smashing like every competition oh, yeah, that was coming yeah. up. I was, I was hated in high school. Nah. Well, you're beautiful. I mean, and you talented. Thank uh, I you. think that's a reason. You know, we Thank team you. light skin. I'm just saying. No, I'm not saying with you. All right. So I see that you perform. You had several performances. Mm-hmm. But one I seen with Jamie Foxx. Oh, yeah, that my. was crazy. How was that? It was a pop up shop, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, tell me a little about that. Um, It was. Uh, I'm going pass out, girl. <laughs> First of all, that weekend itself was crazy. I'll tell you about that later. But yeah. um, when I got there, first of all, I didn't, I didn't expect him to know who I was. I didn't know that he knew. What? I didn't know that he Everybody knew. Everybody knows who this love is. Oh, wow. Go ahead. <laughs> I didn't expect him to even know the song, know who I was. I mean, I know he knew my dad, but yes. I just, you know. So I went. He died. I went. Yeah, he's yeah. a right. I went to just, like, you know, show love or whatever. And he was like, yo, I love your song. Can you please perform it for me? I'm like, what? Right now? Like, for real? He's like, yeah. He was like, send the DJ the song. And I was like, okay. Mm-hmm. And he gave me the mic. And then it just, he knew the words. Oh. I was like, what the hell? It's cool. Oh, my God. Shout out to Jamie Foxx. Yeah, that and was really crazy. the crowd that was around you. It wasn't even like yeah. you just got on the mic and everyone was just like, mm-hmm. they was really watching you. And yeah, I even there for Jamie Foxx. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was really crazy. I didn't expect that at all. Uh, and when you and your father, do y'all team up a lot or no? Just What you mean? Hey, do you work together? Uh, yeah, now we do. Um, <laughs> she said, no, yeah, no, now, <laughs> now, I mean, now that he sees I'm very serious. I mean, I've always been serious about my yes. my career but 
Um, I guess he saw like how far I got on my own. Yes. So he's like, okay, I respect it. Yes. So let's let's try to make something happen. So now we do a lot of our shows together. We do a lot of stuff together now. Yes. We might start doing some photo shoots, you know. So you put your <laughs> own footwork in, and that's really yeah. what he wanted you to see you out there on your own. I don't think he believed me. I don't think he believed that I was dead serious. Like I'm. Was I he like, no, like no, go to school, do lawyer? Was he? More I mean, like, I did really well in high school. So my parents were like, listen, that's what I'm talking you about. tried college. You ain't like it. As long as you're doing something. I remember when I first graduated, my mother was like, listen, you got a year yes. to get this music thing off the road. <laughs> or you either get out of my house or you're going to college. That's so what I'm talking about. From that, it was like, all right, I got to really figure out what I want to do. And man. you know what I love about your story? It wasn't given to you. actually went out yeah. there and got it. I try to tell people that, but they don't believe, believe in me. They Yo, think, I, girl, you know. From Team Life getting off. <laughs> <laughs> listen, we're going to be right, right back. DJ Thank Quiet Storm, give us something to talk about real quick. Congratulations on hitting 21,000 oh, yeah. views. I'm trying to get to 100, man. You said we, excited. Yeah, we, we coming in. We coming yeah. in. You just put it out. I know, but I'm like, wow. man. <laughs> Listen, wait. The, the song air. What was the concept? How did you come up with the song? Um, You know, being in the studio and your people with you and they, you know. Set that pressure. Vibing or whatever. It just... It was like 5 in the morning mm -hmm. And we was just like Alright what are we gonna do Like we've been in the studio <laughs> For 7 hours already What are we doing mm -hmm. So um My producer Motif alumni Big shout out to him He started playing like Um He actually I don't I don't know It started really small but And then it just kept Going and going you, and going like, I thought you bringing back That real R&B Like Thank that you. soul like And you know like When you When you're in the studio And you're making a song Especially from scratch You're not thinking like that You're mm -hmm. just thinking like Alright I'm making a song yes. I want it to sound dope And you just adding stuff Taking stuff out And then when the song Is done with You sit there And listen to it Like ten times you like damn I remember getting in the car And I'm listening to the song I'm, I looked at my mother I'm like ma I'm dead gonna be somebody Watch no. I just said that After listening to the song A million times And you know like the process itself you just 
you just creating and it ends up being something and you can still vibe out you look through your yeah. two steps to the song i wanted to do a it. roller skating nah. Theme, yeah, I felt like it was like. But no, the theme of your video was awesome. Let's Thank jump you. in. Shout that. out to my mom. Yeah. Uh, shout out to your mom. That was crazy. Like the whole outfit, first mm-hmm. of all. How did you even come up with the concept of the style? Um, it was that glitter. Yeah. Or like oh, yeah. Like body paint kind of. Mm-hmm. So my my mom came up with the idea. She's also my wow. manager. Um, she really wanted to go out of the box with it. So for like the that whole month, that was out of the box. Yeah, my dancers. We went and found like body suits and stuff, and we started like painting on. Um, and it was really a trial and error kind of thing because if it didn't work out, you gotta mm-hmm. throw the bodysuit out, start all over again. But the craziest part about it was is black lights. So yes. You have to hold this that little was- light. <laughs> everything in the house is dark. You gotta hold this little light and try to paint it. It was crazy. Even but down then, to the wigs, everything was glowing. Yeah. I'm like, this shit is dope. Mm-hmm. That just is dope. And my sister, she's she's an artist. She paints as well. So yes. she came up from Maryland and she came to the video shoot. She had a paint on there. She. That's what I'm talking about how long yeah. did it take to shoot the video? Uh, I think the shoot was about like five, six hours because mm-hmm. we'd like do a bunch of scenes over and stuff like that. But the sh- the day of the shoot, everything went smooth. Like it was, it was great. I thought, I think the video was beautiful because nowadays everyone just wants to be, you know, yeah. naked in the video or yeah. dropping it like it's hot. And I feel I was, like, you know what? She bringing that class and that you. soul into that R&B, man. I, I was just telling somebody the other day too, like people, artists now forget that you have to match visual to to audio like you got to give people a vibe to follow if not it's just just a song yes and then when people over it they over it if yes. you give them a visual to look at that's something they're gonna remember that's yes. something they, that, that they're gonna want to see so man because I, I keep really going big. i keep going back to your link and <laughs> that youtube link like yeah, i'm real video. big on visuals so i haven't seen a video like that creative and Thank so you. long like i'm telling you everyone's just how do you feel about being a female in the game now uh, i mean i definitely um I think it's a great thing yes. because we, you know, we doing it and we doing it damn well. Yes. So that's a great thing. But I do think it's difficult when you're not a female artist that's like, and listen, to each his own. Yes. But um, to each his own. But I, it's difficult for me because I'm young and I'm not like taking my clothes off yes. and I'm not like, you know, I'm not doing all of that. So I, I like, you know, it's a little you. hard. I applaud you. Thank you. I applaud and it's you. not because, you know, it's not because Like, you said to each his own. Yeah, but like, I applaud but it's just me. Like, you're I just, tasteful. Yeah, you know, I'm, you know. Mm-hmm. That's how I, that's how I'm starting. You know, they want yeah. everybody just to turn. I mean, around. you can still be sexy without being naked, but I don't know. Yeah, we got but a it voice, is a little you, bit but you have harder. a voice too. Yeah, I want to you. hear your voice. I don't always have to see your body. But speaking exactly. of yeah. speaking of shoes, you had a birthday photo shoot. Mm-hmm. Oh man, that one was oh yeah, girl. Thank I was saying you. I was talking your page. No, <laughs> that was actually <laughs> last two years ago. Two years ago. Yeah. All right, so what's your sign? I'm a Libra. Hey now. Yes. Ooh, oh, don't yeah. play with that one. Uh-huh. But how was the photo shoot? Who come up with your style? Yep. My mom, mama. Yeah, oh. my mom. That's my stylist. I'm gonna have manager. to get that number. <laughs> she, yeah, she do everything. She's yeah. Hey, mama. No, no, but no. My no, sister, no. she actually painted on the boots, so she, the jacket. She did the jacket as well. She's she's dope. And even with the concept today. Mom. No, yeah, that's, no. Actually, I think I got up and picked this out too. Uh, yeah. She came in the room. She peeked at me. She said I was doing okay. She was like, you she good? The door. No, no shade. Uh, no shade. No, <laughs> right, like we be right back. She definitely peeked at me though. Like, what you putting on? Shout out to Mama Love. Yes. Yes, DJ yes. Quiet Storm, give him something to talk about, baby. She was Strong Island Hip Radio. Sheena, baby, make sure y'all follow our radio page, SIA.
Yeah. HH number four life. We got Vina Love in the building. Yeah. Talk about it. All right, we were just talking about, uh -huh. you know, we tomboys at heart. Exactly. You know. So, are you into sneaker or heels? I'm 100% into heels. Okay. I'm I mean, right. like... <sighs> I'm not team light skin no more. I love like I love sneakers, but I would just rather spend two hundred dollars on a pair of heels. Talk like. about it. Plus, we got to get ready for them red carpets. Yeah, anyway. you know. Talk about it. I already see you walking a few. Yes. Hey, now, how was it performing at DJ Khaled birthday party? That was another unexpected <laughs> little situation. Tell there. us about that. First of all, yes, <laughs> I'm saying it. I fell. No, I fell. And you know what's so crazy? Every time I fall out of an event, uh -huh. it'd be like the best event I ever went yeah. to. I fell right in front of Andre Harrell. I had my glass in my hand and I girl, fell. Girl. And my drink flew up in the air and he looked at me like, you good? I'm like, yeah. And you yeah. got up and was like, yeah, uh -huh. I'm fine, I'm fine. <laughs> and Shake then it air played, I performed it. And at the end of the party, he came up to me, he's like, listen. <laughs> Um, Don't worry about that. Boy. That was you. I was like, yeah. He was like, oh, we gonna make something happen. We gonna make something happen. Talk about I'm like, it. okay. And he made something happen, girl. Wait till you find no, out. No, it was the you, reason but. you failed in. Exactly. You I'm telling you. Like, oh. Every time I fall, it ends up being like, you, you know. Sure, you ain't do that on purpose. Nah. Nah. I'm nah. <laughs> the shoes I had on, it was meant for me to fall. And I said to them in the car, I'm like, nobody fall. You said no. And I fell. <laughs> I'm telling you, it was for a reason though. Yeah. Oh man, and how was it being up there with your pops? I see every every now and again between he would jump on the mic. Uh -huh. Um, I'm kind of used to it now. All right. You know, like That's we be in the great. house like jamming and stuff. So him being by my side and doing him That's is awesome. like you know. Right so on. with social media, because I see you interact with your fans a lot. Mm -hmm. You know how how you think social media help you grow? Yeah, how growth in general for anyone that's up and coming as well. Um, one, first of all, it's not like back in the days. It's not like you have to have a street team to <clears throat> go in. Like you know, you don't you don't really have to do that. Of course, that helps. But mm -hmm. being on social media, like. It, it allows the world to see yes. you. Like, it's people yes. from South America. Like, you know, stuff yeah, like I, I you see. would never expect. I was on your like, live. No. <laughs> yeah, you would never expect. You never know who's watching you. So I definitely think it helps you. It, it helps people know who you are. And yeah, because like, I seen you with that Beyonce song, girl. Oh, yeah. Oh, my <laughs> God. The, your voice is Thank amazing. You. Who's your favorite artist? My favorite artist is Mary J. Blige. Mary J. Yes. She stole me. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm dead. But my favorite, like, like vocalist, vocalist, uh, definitely. Definitely Etta James, because you know we both got like you know the raspy, deep voice kind of situation. You said you think it must be right? Yeah, All right, you got Girl, it. I could go deep. For Etta James. <laughs> for Etta James. <laughs> so what's in store for 2018? Oh my God, I got so much going on, and I was like out of commission for like a month. So when I came back, my mom was like, "Listen, um, Mama we got like, Yeah, she was like, "Listen." <laughs> You rested. You're okay now, yes. and now we got a lot of stuff to do. So I'm really excited. February is where everything really starts. Mm -hmm. I'll be out a lot, traveling a lot more this I year. Can't so wait to see. I'm excited. I can't wait to see. And when you did that remix to Troy Av song, mm -hmm. when you swung it out, <laughs> did he respond? Did he hit you up? Uh, yeah. Um, he did, and then I also did a you mix for. Um, it was like Neek Bucks, um, G Dot. It was like they did a song together with Webstar. And I like remixed that song too. It was like a mashup. So like they all hit me up at the same time. And I, like a year, not a year later, but a couple months later, I performed at Rucker with my, my former partner, Millville. And they all came to the show. And it was it was really dope. It was cool. Right. Well, any album or EP, anything dropping soon? <sighs> yes. Yeah. I actually have um, the remix to Air is dropping. So that's gonna be crazy. You don't know who's on it, but it's crazy. Oh, it's really on. crazy. I can't. Believe, it's so crazy. I cried when I heard it. Like, okay. Yeah. So crazy. we have to wait for that one. Yeah. All right. Guys. It's gonna be dope, though. It's, it's gonna be dope. Super dope. Yes. All right. I, you're not gonna spill just a little. Nope. No, like she's I mean, not my, No, I can't. No, I'm still trying. I, can't. <laughs> I want to, but I can't. You said not even the first letter. He's no? from Cali, though. He's from Cali. Oh. Cali been showing me so much love. I'm going back there in February for All Star Weekend. So. Oh. And Glo oh yeah, I'm performing at the Global Spin Awards as well. Yeah, so that's gonna be crazy. Oh my! And you know what's funny? We might be doing media at the All Star Game, so we just See might there. be seeing you there. Yeah, that red carpet girl. My Talk about on. it. <laughs> I'm gonna be there with my sneaker heels. I don't know about all that hell. I'm waving because I'm sitting down. No. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Miss Mina Love. Is there anything you want to up and come in um, the know before we go? Listen, follow your dreams. Don't let nobody tell you no. No is not an option. No is not an answer. Make it happen. Make it work. Even okay. if you broke, yeah. there's a way. Hey, and, um, follow me on Instagram, V I N A underscore L O V E. If you click the link in my bio, you'll see the visual to air, and air is avail available on all major platforms. All major platforms. Yes. All right, now, and anything in the future? 
You'll see. Back holding line. I'm saying mama, uh, mama, mama love clothing I want to start a shoe line. So All right. Bad. I want to. Uh, oh, yeah. My shoe's going to be sick. Uh, we're going to talk to mama love because uh, I'm going to need that. Maybe you <laughs> might get me back into the wearing shoes. Hello. All right. You want to give any shout outs real quick? Yeah. Shout out to my team. No days off. Shout out to my sister, the artist, Art of Hardy. Shout out to my father, Kick Capri. Like I said, he's all right. Shout out to my whole team. Shout out to my mom, my manager. Shout out Tuesday. Um, my assistant, Brianna. Um, yeah. The whole team. 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 I love team, the word yes. team, man. It's a lot of us. Team. All right. Shout out to Tuesday <laughs> Entertainment. This is your girl, Oop Gina, baby. And I just got the exclusive from being alive. Mm. Shout out to Mama Love, man. I'm going to yes. have to get that number later. <laughs> GV Sneaker Store. DJ Quiet Storm. Give them something to talk about, baby. Girl Vina Love, and you're rocking with Strong Island Hip Hop Radio.